I shouldn't really agree to do this. I do see that as an opportunity for me to claim the slate a little. Defend myself against these horrible accusations. Very well. You don't want one to point the finger. My job is to give people the story. You don't mind if I record this interview, do you? Not at all. But don't be surprised if I refuse to answer any questions. Seeing as the case is still unsettled. Okay, I understand that you're currently a suspect in the Riley case, which involves three counts of murder. And I hear you're pleading not guilty. Is this true? Yes. I can honestly say that I'm not a murderer. And I find any extremely appalling to be accused of something like this. I tell you, once this trial is over, I will be taking legal action. And by God, I'll be milking every last penny for every prick that's involved in this. It's a very big accusation to have thrown at someone. Murder. Sources indicate that there's a witness willing to testify. He saw you that night. I'm quite aware of that. I'm a smart man. I've looked into it and my attorney has informed me that a junkie is not a credible witness. Do you have a violent history? Not at all. There's not a violent burn in my body. What about the school? Nothing I can remember off the top of my head. You don't mind if I eat? Go ahead. I did a brief background check and apparently in 1995 a call be high you were involved in one bodily grievous harm to an Edmund Kinyak. Oh yes, Edmund. What can I say? It was so long ago. Do you have an alibi to where you were that night? Next question. Do you want some? No, no I'm, I'm fine. Did you have any kind of relationship with the victims? No comment. Look. Is this really necessary? What can you tell me about your ex-wife? Denise. What about her? She's passed on, hasn't she? How did she die? She fell down some stairs, all right? Look, I wouldn't want to dig too deep down on me, all right? Well, can you tell me who ended the relationship? Um, I'm sorry. This interview's over. But when's the last time you saw her? Last. I'll see you now. Cut the interviews and you'll look good on your behalf. I know what you're doing, and I don't like it. The very thought Amanda makes my stomach curl. And you're just bringing up my ex-wife. This doesn't help. I'm sorry. I'll see you out. But Mr. Jeffries. Goodbye.